Hello, good afternoon, good evening, or good morning anywhere you are in the world. This is Jaime recording videos of mushrooms. I am looking at one of the really good edible mushrooms of the Rocky Mountains. This one is called King Bolit in the common name and in the scientific name this is um, uh, Boletus edulis which is one of the best edible mushrooms I'm gonna cut it right now with the knife it's still right now at the baby stage which is actually better because they uh, they don't have maggots at this stage so I'll be cutting it from the very deep area because all this part that you see here all this is edible so I'm gonna cut it pretty low and I'm actually going I'm going to dig a little bit because I don't want to waste too much of this um, some people just grab them I'm actually thinking about that but they said that it can damage the mycelium below although uh, that we don't really know uh, I'm gonna still cut it anyway and we'll see how it looks underneath because underneath is like a sponge okay I think I cut it enough but still not coming out oh right. there it is now we can see the bottom part what it looks like look really beautiful mushroom king bolete some people call it porcini i just call it porcini too even though some people call it bol uh, king bolete the scientific name is boletus edulis again and uh, it's one of the best edible mushrooms you can see here it looks like a loaf of bread and the bottom part is really swollen so you can see that part the base part um, the venation that you see here is also an indication of the really good edible mushroom uh, there's a toxic one that uh, is found also here this is in the gallatin forest of the rocky mountains here in montana and uh, this is where I find it so this is gonna be cooked when they grow a little bigger they actually have maggots inside and if they have tiny maggots that's no problem eating them unless the mushroom stinks already then you don't eat it anymore but at this stage it's perfect it doesn't have any maggots um, if it grows a little bigger and you find it that's still solid enough to cut it then you can eat it and the maggots are not not a problem because they are beetle larvae so they are actually pretty good and they have a lot of protein so this one i'm going to be eating it i am actually hunting mushrooms um, here in the mountain i'm actually handicapped and i have my canes with me but i'm still able to find a few mushrooms i just get around I try to hold on the twigs of the trees um, this mushroom I have here I will be putting it in a paper bag since it's small enough so I carry paper bags with me when they are bigger I cannot put them in paper bags because they are huge they can grow like 10 times as much as this one so this one I will be I'm really happy that I found this one. Uh, earlier I found somewhere else which I'm going to be showing that in, in, in a different video. Um, sorry I cannot put this. But this one for now it's a King Bolit. Thank you for watching my videos and I will be posting more things about foraging in the mountains of the Rocky Mountains. Um, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Please give some thumbs up share the video if you could thank you very much again